A warning tonight for construction workers. Minneapolis police say thieves are targeting them on the job. There's been at least 14 recent incidents, mostly in South Minneapolis. WCCO's Kirsten Mitchell reports on what we know about the crimes and how workers can protect themselves. This year, we've really been hit with a lot of construction. The many projects underway in South Minneapolis are hard to miss. Compared to a normal year, this is really intense, so it's, it's been a lot. Um, the guys here every day. That's why Bruce Ami was stunned to learn that workers are being targeted by thieves. I was completely surprised. Police say in at least 14 incidents this month, a group of seemingly juveniles have targeted construction workers who mostly speak Spanish. The vehicle break ins are happening while they're on the job site. They have things that they keep in their cars and you know they're they're working just trying to do their job and they're vulnerable and it's kind of sad that they're getting victimized. Police say in some of the robberies a gun was used. Items stolen include weapons, cash, wallets, passports and power tools. I'm guessing it's just opportunity probably. Neil Sheridan says the area often feels safe. If I was a worker, I would feel I probably wouldn't be thinking to lock it if I'm just running in and out of the house, you know. He says neighbors will continue to look out for each other, while police encourage anyone who hires contractors to let them know about the trend. They say to always lock vehicles, never store personal documents inside them, and keep serial numbers of work tools in case they're found. And it's kind of like the people that they're targeting are vulnerable, and the people that are doing the crime are wrecking their own lives by by doing this sort of thing, you know, and they have no idea what the consequences are. So it's just sad all around. In Minneapolis, Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO News. Police say some arrests have been made. If you see suspicious behavior, including people looking into cars, trying door handles, call 911.